For some reason, people have gotten in their heads that fraternities are nothing more than an exclusive drinking club. This couldn't be further from the truth. Fraternities are way more than that. They are a brotherhood. They offer one another support as well as better their community and universities through service and charity. Today's media has put fraternities in a negative light. Sites like Total Frat Move and The Movie Neighbors make it seem that they are only interested in partying, drugs, and beautiful women. It is these types of images that lead people to believe that fraternities have a negative effect on campus and cause problems with the local authorities. Dude, people don't think fraternities contribute back to their community. Are you serious? I know, right? Take JMU, for example. Delta Sigma Phi just had their spring philanthropy event, Delta Sig Dog Days. They brought dogs to campus, and all the proceeds went to the local SPCA. Here, roll the clip. This philanthropy event brought dogs to JMU's campus from shelters all around Harrisonburg. People came and paid $4 to play with dogs and puppies all day. The event raised over $2,500, all of which went to the local SPCA. The SPCA even had representatives on site in case anyone fell in love with one and would like to adopt one of these dogs in the process. This lucky pup is Charlie. She was adopted from Dog Days by Ashley Collins, a JMU student. Delta Sig Dog Days is just one of the many events that fraternities all across the country put on to give back to their communities. Fraternities also offer their members a group of brothers they can lean on for support. They provide younger students with a group of upperclassmen to help guide them through college. And after college, having a large number of alums in the workforce can be a great advantage in networking. And in today's market, the smallest advantage goes a long way. Kyle Griever, one of the brothers in Phi Gamma Delta at the University of Maryland, was recently diagnosed with a rare form of bone cancer. And even though the brothers at the JMU chapter didn't know Kyle well, their spring philanthropy event supported his fight against cancer. They put on a southern crawfish boil with the proceeds going to keep Kyle's fight going. They ended up raising over $5,000 for his cause. There will always be a certain stigma surrounding fraternities. Just don't believe everything you see on TV. 48% of all U.S. presidents and 40% of all U.S. Supreme Court justices were Greek. We've seen today that fraternities do a lot of good for their community and schools. So if you're interested in learning more about Greek life, you should check out your school's fraternity and sorority life page and to learn more. Whew. Now we're done. Let's go drink some. Let's go, dude.